Hi, in this video, we are going to set up the TOX using a web browser. The web browser we are going to use is Internet Explorer. So the first thing we need is the IP address of the NVR. We can fetch it from the network tab in TCP IP. In this case, it's ending with 249. Our password is set by default admin123 that we set it up in NVR. We have accessed the NVR. Second thing we need to do is access the setting tab in the top left corner. And we need to go to the camera tab. Once we are in the camera tab, we can see the list of cameras connected to the NVR. We need to relocate, we need to locate the TOC camera and open the web page. Once the web page is open, we just need to enter the credentials. That's admin123 again. And we can have the access to the camera. So in this setting tab, we just need to go to video. So the this is the tab that opens. In the Illuminator, we have three profiles. Day night general, we can set it up for all three of them. By default, it's set to auto, but we can keep it always on by setting it up in manual. As you can see, the LED turned on, or we can set it to off position. That will, uh, the LED will stay off all the time. And in auto, the lens will automatically detect the daylight and it will turn on the LEDs. So we can set it up for all the three profiles to auto. And the backlight, uh, we can, for again, for the three profiles, we can set the mode to WDR, wide dynamic range. So this one, is useful for brightly lit or uh, poorly lit areas. So this is a really good feature of the camera. Once the conditions of the video are set, we can hop to the next audio conditions. So in the audio conditions, the mains in the mainstream, it should be enabled. Uh, as we know that uh, the, it's a two-way talk camera. So we need to go to the attributes in the line in. We need to change it to mic and noise filter should be enabled. And once we press save, this will enable the two-way talk to the camera. The next two things we are going to set up uh, is active deterrence and artificial intelligence. The active deterrence is with the red blue light and the siren of almost around 110 dB. It's a really loud siren. So we, are, we need to access the event tab. And uh, from here, we can in go to video detection so in the video detection it should be enabled we can set up the area where we want to cover our motion detection so anything that's in red that is covered uh, in the motion detection zone uh, once it detects a motion uh, the alarm and the warning light will turn on and uh, it will just scare the intruder away. So we can set up the durations as well from here. Uh, if it's from, this one is 24 hours, it will work, but we can always add two periods and add a blank period in between them. Once we save it, a, this is applicable to all. The second thing in this one is the smart motion detection. So that's our AI feature. Smart motion detection uses complex AI algorithms and uh, it only detects humans and motor vehicles. The sensitivity is set to medium and we'll leave it like that. The third thing we are going to do is the perimeter setup. So the perimeter setup is in the, in the smart plan, we need to on the light bulb and save it. And then we can go to IBS and we can set up two zones. We can set up a trip wire or a, we can set up a intrusion zone. So this is bi-directional. So it's A to B and B to A. So we can set up the duration of the of this rule. Uh, from We can change it from 24 hours to the determined period. So... Uh, how to do that? We just need to draw the rule. In this case, we are just doing a trip line draw rule. So we just point the cursor from point A to point B. If someone crosses this line, 
then we will then these two deterrents will become active so the audio linkage and the warning light and we can change the audio linkage to the pre-recorded messages from here and the warning light we can set it up for five seconds and just save it then it will just I'll, then this trip wire will become active so these are the these are the few things that uh, we we use uh, to enable this camera to the full capacity hope you like the video and uh, i'll see you in the next one